The skateboards go faster. Yeah. Everything we do is connected to energy. When we introduce a fusion power skateboard, energy comes from many different places. Hydro. Be too old to ride on. And nuclear. Now, get ready for the newest, the ultimate form of energy. Gold Fusion Power Generation. With corporate offices in Nevada and subsidiaries in Alabama, Canada, Korea, and Europe, IESI is a clean energy company. World-class scientists and technicians that make up IESI have been working over a decade to bring the world power energy generated by cold fusion. This process is now ready to be commercialized throughout the world. IESI has been involved in cold fusion since its inception. IESI is the company that is bringing cold fusion to the world with an extremely talented team of scientists headed by Dr. Hyunik Yang. For the last two years, work has progressed on various prototype cold fusion reactors owned by IESI. At the moment, IESI has three cold fusion units in their technical facility in Edmonton, Alberta. The units prove cold fusion works, is economical, pollution-free, reliable, clean and safe. The technology is ready for mass production. The cold fusion device operated by IESI that has the highest power output is the water heavy water fuel process. The device works by burning the deuterium with hydrogen in the water. The process is a simple one in that the atoms is producing HE3 and heat or electricity. The radiation levels produced are non-detectable at low to medium powers, but do require moderate shielding at higher powers from both neutron and gamma radiation. IESI has produced an inexpensive high power source that is safe. The cold fusion system has a much lower operating cost and capital costs are lower than conventional power units. The heat that is produced is used to heat water or other fluids, which in turn spin a turbine. In addition, this heat can be converted in the form of superheated steam to generate electrical power in the conventional manner. The heat may be used for other purposes, such as heating buildings or operating processes. If electrical power is produced, it is direct current electricity, which may have a voltage from 10 volts to 1 million volts. Simply stated, IESI now knows how to extract energy from water and heavy water by using the deuterium to react with hydrogen to produce HE3 and energy. This procedure does use a very small portion of the water and heavy water, but not enough to significantly change the volume. The exact details of how we are getting the deuterium and hydrogen to react, we wish to keep confidential until our patent is published. IESI has filed patents on all its processes through the world and patents application numbers number 60-593.180, 60-593.181, Korean patent application number 10-2002-0069231. Apparatus for Generating Hydrogen Gas Worldwide Patent Cooperation Treaties, PCT, Patent Number KR2003-002395. The first device you see is one where the fluid is pumped about in a loop. The fluid is rich in deuterium and hydrogen. As the fluid circulates, it passes through what we at IESI call the cell. In the cell, the cold fusion reaction takes place. The video you are seeing shows the process and the working cell. In this particular case, the energy from the cold fusion reaction is being used to heat the fluid, which may be oil or water, with a high level of deuterium in the hydrogen-rich fluid. The heat, in turn, can be used to produce steam, which in turn can spin a turbine to generate electricity or be used to heat buildings via a hot water heating loop or anything else one should want to heat. The temperature can be as low as 100 degrees Celsius to as high as 4,000 degrees Celsius or higher if the fluid can tolerate the temperature. In conclusion, IESI from this technology can generate massive volumes of electricity simply by generating or producing steam. This steam is then applied to standard equipment such as steam turbines which turn a standard generator to produce the electricity which is conditioned via inverters, capacitor banks, standard switchgear currently being used worldwide to export power, electricity to the grid systems anywhere in the world.
This technology provides clean energy with no pollutants or waste streams such as spent fuels or solid waste materials. This process has no exhaust gases which normally are released to the atmosphere in standard fossil fuel fired plants. This new technology will provide mankind a new demarcation in energy production. Imagine a world with clean and endless power energy. The possibilities are limitless. That's her. So our future is the same as our past. Hydrogen. Yeah. <laughs> that's very true. Because that's what they claim we started out with, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's it. What's happened since then? Yes. Yes, I think. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I, 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 From my perspective, if I had known it was going to take 18 years, I sure as hell wouldn't have started on it. No, no, yeah, if I had known it would process. take that long, I would have. Uh, my my, my uh, timetable was uh, 1995. Mm -hmm. Yes, it was. Yeah. Well, mm -hmm. yes, if you hadn't got the ring, that probably would have. Yes, if I hadn't got the ring, I would have got mm -hmm. to. I would have got to a device in 1995. Mm -hmm. They had just not the 